Good evening. Hopefully you don't guys don't mind that I'm weaved out tonight. I just felt like the mood. So tonight I'm gonna be doing a quick little review of my Saber Altar PVC figure, which is right next to me, right up in a second. Um, I'm not a fan of Vanilla Saber. I don't like Vanilla Saber, but her Altar form, it's starting to grow on with me. It is. I do prefer Altars. Like I have Salt, I have Salter, I have two Jolter figures back there. You know, I just hate Vanilla characters. So without further ado, let's take a look at this. The attention to detail with this spot on i'll turn off my little spotlight so you can actually get a little bit more detail this thing looks godlike at night mm. you can definitely tell a lot of heart and soul went into the design it's great the pvc pvc itself flawless you definitely tell a lot of heart and soul is put into this i don't like saber faces per se i really don't there's a crap ton of them there's a shit ton of saber faces there's look at nero back there this Soji Okita, which I just did a video on. I have a Saber Lily coming in. I just hate Saber faces. They're just, I'll, I'll just, just a lot of them. But I am a fan of this one at least. I'm a fan of the dress. I'm not a fan of all the armor that comes with this character. A lot of armor is no bueno for me. Jalter did it right. Jalter was good. Like we have. Vanilla John up there, and we have Jolter up here. Vanilla John doesn't have a lot of armor. Jolter is just a darker variant of said armor. But for some weird reason, this one, crap ton of armor. That's why I prefer the Saber Lily variant of Vanilla Saber. It's just no bueno with me. So, a couple cons with this. Like I said, the PVC itself, spot on. Only issues I have is the sword hand. There's little to no grip on that. Easily comes out, which makes moving this a pain. Because remember, my shit's unprotected. I'm not trying to flex, but it's just how it is right now. It's just unprotected. Third world problems, not that big of a deal. Not a deal breaker. Let me turn her around. It says Altria. I know, FGO does this. Ticks me off. I played Vanilla Fate Stay Night. I played Fate Unlimited Codes. I read the damn visual novel. I read the lewd visual novel. Don't do that shit. Don't do that shit when you are have company over. But uh, it's Artorian. It's straight up Artorian. FGO does it. Does it trigger me? It kind of does, but I know who they're talking with. But hey, it is what it is. Also, here's your glamour shot for the day. If you, I can't even see it properly. Let me actually take this out. Um... Would I trade this PVC for the world? No, I like this PVC for what it is. Here's your glamour shot. They're black. I, pr I promote wholesome content on this channel. Would I trade this PVC for the world? Mm, I like it for what it is. It's, it's easy to put together. That's it. Just put her on her little stool. There you go. A little platform. So like I said, it's not a deal breaker having her name being Altria. It's not a deal breaker having her having little to no support on this sword but um i'm not complaining for, i'm not complaining it's a good figure pretty expensive figure it was a great figure when it dropped i'm glad to have it here's another dark shot of it that shit looks straight up godlike at night mm. Mm -mm 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 -mm. so this was a quick little review of my saucer pvc figure there'll be a little bit more of this coming on because we have a shit ton of pvcs to review and we have a shit ton of shit coming from japan so till next time we meet sayonara we out Good night, guys.